Hello guys, welcome back to Concrete Elbow. If you don't want to know the result of this match without watching it yourself, please do click away from this video right now. Nisa Jamadan vs Sarah Collins Round 1 looked really equal. They both went for a top roll and slipped right away. In the straps, Nisa top rolled Sarah easy. 1-0 Nisa. Round 2 outside the straps both went for a top roll again. But just before they slipped, Nisa was able to pin Sarah. That's what I thought. Because turns out Nisa elbow fouled just right before. In this round, there were multiple fouls from their elbows and early starts. At the end, they both got two fouls each. And then Nisa was able to get the pin in the final start outside the straps. 2-0 Nisa. Round 3, Nisa decided to go Levon mode and just stop Sarah in the center and then pin her easily. 3-0 Nisa. Round 4, Bill Collins said it was a slip from a losing position from Sarah. Bill was about to give the win to Nisa, but Sarah said she didn't slip from a losing position. Nisa didn't care and said let's just go to the straps, so they just went to the straps anyway. In the straps, Nisa Levon mode again, held her for a few seconds, pinned Sarah easily. 4-0 Nisa. Round 5 was pretty interesting. Sarah was in like a Cobra Rhodes exploding hand. But the difference is she was on a defensive position, and she was on Nisa's side of the table. Nisa was like going for a flop press, but only with her thumb. Anyways, it was declared a pin, so 5-0 Nisa. Round 6, 6-0, easy top roll. Congratulations Nisa.